All right. Back for uh, game number two. You made the right call. Game number two. Then I'm recording anyway. I don't know if either of these will show up on the YouTube channel, but last game I played, I got I ended up in Primordials Assassins. Well, Primordials, I, I guess. I shouldn't be saying Primordial Assassin Mage because there are no other Primordial comps. For me, this is an easy embarrassment. I'll pick that over chainmail. And yes, I will lock to get a pair of Drow Rangers. I'm fine with that. So. So I feel like Draw Ranger's not that great of melee comps. <laughs> you have to do like a box formation just so anybody, at least somebody gets the attack speed bonus. Like it's so weird. Oh yeah, these are, uh, this is a boss lobby for those. Uh, uh, probably Gloves of Haste. I think Hooded Defiance has really gone up as far as um, usability, but it's probably Gloves of Haste, and there it is. So I can take the, um... God. What do I do? I'm gonna lock this. We might be Primordials again. I was Primordials last game. Cause I want bo oh, both, honestly. That was weird. So it looked like Draw Ranger wasn't taking damage, but she was. <laughs> that was that was a strange one. I don't think I want Arcane Boots here. I think I actually want Blightstone. This is, this is fine. I guess I'll buy Timber Saw, but I'm probably selling Timber Saw. Because, like, I wanted the two star Draw Ranger for at least the early rounds. Um, they actually think they're going to beat us. But that round we also got a lot of primordial units so i want i wanted everything that's why i locked yeah that's rough axe might die yeah tiny might die too i don't think we win this but uh, we, we actually do win because of the token nice So I think I want to plan to get interest, not this round, but the next round. Let's throw a Razor in. Razor's trash, but... Actually, no. Let's throw Tiny in. I want both of these assassins. I guess I just buy them. Smart move. We definitely want Viper. Yeah, I'd rather have two tinies than a tiny and a razor. This is how I feel. <laughs> oh, maybe razor would have did something here with lichen. We do have less AOE. Oh, I feel like tiny is just a better unit. Oh. 
And now we, uh, now we have to put somebody in. Let's do, uh, let's do, uh, PA for now. And not econing, which is very bad. I'm coming for you. I didn't know Morphling was still alive. Uh, we still lose this, I think. Pretty sure. Yup. Oh well. So let's spend this now. I guess I could have had that. Yeah. Yeah, I could have had that, uh... Or could I have? Not sure. Yeah, I probably did. I think I wasted that. I would have two-star razor. But then I put in a PA, though, over razor, and PA did pretty well. I'm just going to spend this now. Yeah, they fine. Will die swiftly. This time it must be different. My economy shot because I'm, I'm just trying to piece anything together right now. Viper is gonna come in now, or Razor. I probably throw a Razor in. Maybe I throw a Razor in over Draw Ranger, but I don't think so. I mean, that could be right. It's like, do I want... I think I just want Razor. I just want the two-star unit. It's between throwing the two-star unit in... Um, and we can't do it yet. Alright, now I'll fight for this interest point. If we win this round, then... Um, I thought about doing Razor Maybe over Morphling. Maybe I should have. I need a double bat riders. Wow, they got six bat riders by round eight. They went hard for knights. They're just on. <laughs> they're hell bent on knights. God. We lost badly. That's fine. So if we had won that, we would have gotten extra gold worth of interest. But we didn't. So that's all right. So Razor can come in because now we're going to be level five. Like, to be fair, I don't think Razor would have done much there. Sure. I'll spend. Yeah, that's fine. We'll buy the Slark too. And then whichever one we get to two, uh, two star, we sell the other one. I think Razor's legit only decent against those the savage comps. Because they make tokens. Like, you can at least kill those. But it doesn't kill any actual units. Like, 100 damage. Up to 3 cells away is nothing. And it's up to, it's not even like a flat 100 damage. Okay. We sell, uh. We make this and sell these. I could have done some shenanigans to try and get to 20. And get another gold worth of interest, but I don't know. We have to buy those. Is 
Is it now time to give up Drow Ranger? I wonder. Oh, summoning stone is huge. Yeah, that's big. That's that's insane. Cause now the primordials that we get, they have more attack speed. They have higher attack speed and higher health. I think I missed uh, buying something there. I'm pretty sure I did. Our economy's so bad. <laughs> it's it's actually legit terrible. Um. Not saving money at all. Very little, anyway. See? Razor didn't do anything. Pretty sure that did 50 damage. If even that. Mark had to come in and clean up. Uh, one of these days, I, need, I, I should probably risk it and try Elusive. Just try elusive hunters, see see if it works. It probably won't work, but I have an idea of what the build path is for it. Like where you could even potentially have scale for magic resistance. And it'll work as long as nobody goes like six mages. I probably should move drow here. So that way, uh, drow and razor should stay put. Yeah, I stay put. Oh god, got him. Literally the best possible situation in Razor. Still does no damage. Start with the cleanup. Do we go to six here? I think we do. We aggressively take that. We need a third mage. Preferably a fourth mage. It might be time to actually, uh, yeah. It's time. Draw Ranger's gone. Important to least, most important to least important. Is this guy actually on? No, he's just on Savage. Nice. All right. I haven't even been looking at my health. We're actually doing extremely well, especially since we kind of hit a power spike. Like we just we just know what we want now as far as units. Like we're we're definitely in this comp, especially since we got summoning stone. So now we'll stay at thirty. Now I can start probably start I can I can econ now. I'm at ninety health. No one else is in my comp. Everyone's like, there's a lot of hunters in this lobby. I mean, just like, there's only one knight. I could have followed the top person into knights. And I would have, I'd probably still would be okay. Maybe. I think I was offered some amount of knights. Kill him! Thank you. Maybe summoning stone help there. We're rolling. Let's ride the win streak. Maybe change my positioning if something happens, potentially. Well, I have to change it here. I forgot. So, you're there. 
I just want to make sure they all jump tiny. I don't want them to jump Razor or Puck. I mean, I guess if they jump Puck, it's okay. Because Puck has face shift now. But, I don't know. I don't want Lena as my third mage. No, I already have Razor. I already have to deal with the fact that Razor is one of my mages. I don't want to have to deal with Lena and Razor being my ma two mages. That's terrible. God, it did nothing. <sighs> Plasma Field did nothing. It's alright. I, mean, I guess Arc Warden's gonna carry this build. This time I have a much better... I actually... I have the real Slark and not the fake Slark in Bloodseeker. So I might be alright. Let's see, Brucha the Aggressor? I think I want that. Because I think it's... Uh... I might even want it on Puck, actually. Yeah, I'm chilling. I have nothing to put in for level 7. I mean, I could buy this Lena after this round and then level up to 7. But I really need to finish this Razor. So I don't know. Yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna pre-level. It doesn't benefit me, I don't think. Oh god. They have Mark Warden already. Oh Slark, you were my carry. Wow. So there aren't There's a lot of hunters in this lobby. A lot. Alright, I'll buy Lena. I hope I get to but... punch my sister in the face. She's not useful. She's pretty bad. She's almost as bad as Razor. I think she's better than Razor, but she's definitely one of the worst, if not the worst, tier two unit in the game. Oh. We did it, smile. So, Blightstone goes on you, you go there, Aggressor probably goes on Morphling. We did it. Now we just need to find Enigma at level 8 or 9, and then we can replace Razor, and then get another mage. Like, uh... I don't know, we have Razor, Puck, and no one else right now. So we need two, yeah, we need two mages. Probably Crystal Maiden, and Lich, hopefully. I'm, that means I'm hoping to get two tier five units. Are they actually, like, come on, bro. Really? Look at this. That's so dumb. This is the meta. People just take Arc Wardens. They just don't care. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna take Arc Wardens. I don't care. Whiskey Pete. Can we can we chunk through their armor? How many knights do they have? They're on four. Okay, so they're not maxed out yet. They might not be maxed out. They're trying this Bloodbound. They have BTCs. Which is really stupid. I wish they'd nerf this. I think it's ob incredibly obnoxious. But... See, they just, they just get bigger. That's all. That's just the annoying thing about them. I'm probably not keeping Slark. Yeah. We can't do Slark yet. I 
haven't found a viper yet, but I haven't been rolling much. I'm just kind of coasting. Oh. Stun. Oh crap. Slark is not gonna help the squad. I mean, <laughs> he is not helping the squad at all. Face shift! Puck, dodge forever, please! I mean, Puck basically dodged forever. I thought Puck was actually going to be the last one to die for a second there. No one went scrappy either. Not that I'm going scrappy. Alright. We finished it. At least Razor is three now. Uh, we have Slark. We don't need those. Uh, is Keeper of the Light possibly in our future? Like, at all? It's maybe. We have Razor Puck right now. Maybe I want Keeper of the Light? It would mean I get to uh, focus my assassins on one side and my mages on the other. I think I'm gonna do it. I don't want big time contract, not now. Um, but I'll take Maelstrom. We'll throw you in. Get Keeper of the Light. Uh, Maelstrom goes on Arc Warden. Uh, Blightstone. On Slark. Alright, yeah, let's do this. There we go. Do I want Dragon Knight? I don't think so. Okay. I'll sit for now. Look at me trying to roll for Enigma. It's hilarious. I might play Keeper up here, actually. Yeah, I feel like I should. I think I want to put Keeper in front of uh, Arc War and not to the left. Also, Keeper's not getting his ability cast off at all. It's because his attack speed is really, really bad. Really bad. Yeah, let's do that actually. So huge. I need to fight for the interest. I could sell Shadow Shaman. I guarantee it. I'll do it. It's fine. It will be okay. Alright. Keeper of the Light is basically staying in. Ow. Got him. See? Now he actually gets his ability off. It's 
So if I find Enigma, I might even replace Razor. Straight up. Not kidding. Because three star Razor is still bad. I lose uh I lose four gold by doing that, but it's just that bad. Final by Sark. Uh-oh. Yo, Maelstrom's pretty good on Arc Warden. Pretty decent on Arc Warden. So, I have my assassins like this because I want to try to get them to all jump the same area. So, there's a chance that they focus on the same target. Because I'd rather focus fire with the way assassins work after learning, reading about it. I'm just kinda, although like this, I think it's, this is the only part that matters, not this. So I should probably have them like, like if I wanna hit someone in the corner, see they all focus fired that guy. If I lose a round, I'll reposition the assassins a bit, but it's going to stay relatively, basically the same. We should have this. Yep. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not guaranteed top four yet, so... So who would be my... My ninth unit would probably be another Arc Warden. There's Daedalus. Oh, there's Bracers. I could put it on Keeper of the Light. Yeah, let's do that. I kind of like that idea. I'll buy it. I might buy Crystal Maiden too. I don't know. Yeah, I'll buy it. Oh, hello. I guess Bracers doesn't help against Sniper. I don't think we've beaten that guy yet. They're trying to go six. Yeah, like we're not. <laughs> Alright, let's put Sark here and switch that up a bit. Is it a trap? I can't do it anyway. I need like, I need 30 gold to get to level nine. And that's if I wait. I mean, I could do it. This is 10 gold now. This is eight gold now. Like maybe I could make it. God. Keeper needs to like not die from this. Yes, end it. End it. We done. Yeah, fine. I'm gonna feel real bad if I literally lose four gold if I <laughs> if she doesn't never comes in. I just I have to not roll uh if I roll once. It's not worth, it's not even worth rolling here. It just isn't. 
like the plan is to get to nine and throw crystal main in. That's the plan. Or maybe another Slark. Maybe. Wow, someone got deleted. It was Tiny. <laughs> tiny got deleted. No! This ogre has Helm! Why, dude? End it. Gone. Merlin. Thirty. Do we do it? How much did I say it was gonna be? Thirty gold. Yeah, we do it and just blow our entire economy. Let's go. All right, we're at nine. We're we're with everybody else. We get more mana generation. Oh God, is this guy? I can't. I've. I can't beat- I, I don't know! Can we beat this guy now? Argorn got hooked. Keeper, like, shot the wrong way. So that's a pog. This is still close. Wow! We did it! I think I want to change Keeper, though. Um... I think I want him there. Probably here? Yeah, probably like that. I can't believe we pulled that off. That's insane. Yeah, I'm just gonna econ here. Actually, no. I shouldn't econ. No, I shouldn't econ. We're looking for stuff. Right? Who has tiny? I don't think anybody has tiny except me. Yeah. The tinies we can find at our leisure. What about Puck? Puck's not contested either. What about Slark? And Slark's not contested. So it's possible that I can uh, just econ. Maybe. That's a tombstone. Okay. So. I think this is the perfect spot for tombstone. Yeah, I think that's a good spot. And I think because we can find tiny Puck and Slark at our leisure. Nobody else has those units. I think we can uh, try to earn a little bit of interest. Just try to slow roll. Unless I'm that desperate for Tiny. Which I guess I could be, but now that I have Summoning Stone, I'm like not that worried. destroyed them. Barely, but we got there. I could have sold a puck. No, I could have sold a tiny to try and uh, fight for the interest point there, but nah. We got puck. So normally I could roll and um, still have 11 gold and still get interest, but I'm trying to hit, uh, if I win this round, I'll get the winning streak gold, the base gold, and the interest, which means I'll have 20 gold and then I can chill again. And now we have puck at three star. I'm uh, even less worried. Although we're fighting the ghost of the top guy. Only lost 30 HP the whole game. Well, Keeper got hooked and still managed to. Uh... All right, we beat we beat the top guy in the lobby. That's pretty good. 
It's pretty good. All right, so now we're in top four, so now we're not gonna lose rank. The problem is I don't know if I can consistently beat the top guy. I'm not sure. Yeah, like I'm kind of just coasting right now. So now if we win again, we can get to 30 gold. So it's like, how long do I want to play this game before I start rolling down? I don't think I roll down until I actually lose. Then I roll down. At that point, at that point we'll roll. Until then, like I'm sitting. Until I, I get to, either I lose or I get to a decent amount of gold to where I don't mind rolling. Which is probably 40. It's not 50. I don't have to get to 50. It looks like this time we're going to lose against Whiskey Pete. Or not. Yeah, we won. That's insane. I think that completes the win streak. No, not yet. So now we got 10. Now we're at 30. Um, I think we do it again. We just chill. I think once I get to 40, I'll be comfortable rolling. Maybe I'll, I'll like be willing to roll like 20 gold. Or down to 20 gold. And try to find these up, finish up these upgrades. I don't plan on getting to 10. I mean, I guess I could. That's round 37. I would spend 40 gold to get to 10 to put in a, a Slark. That's what I would put in. Or whatever ace unit I find that I bought. I guess it's a plan. Alright, well, we can't beat this guy. Alright, I guess now we're rolling. <laughs> Here and then I went here and here, so I think it's something like this. Crap. Oh, this is fine. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're fine. so we get the four gold here because we waited till after the round started that's a Dagon the problem with Dagon is that um people try to put it on Arc Warden and then like he doesn't uh two things don't die so I think I'm comfortable rolling here I said it would cost 40 gold, right? Mm, that's a lich. I think we do it. I think we're going for it. Wow, they moved up. I didn't expect them to move up. It might be a good thing. We don't have Aegis either. We didn't pick it up. That was way closer. Right, I'll... We'll go to 10.
we get chain frost twice. That's the first one. As long as Lich doesn't get one shot, we'll get another one. Maybe even. Shot the wrong one. Mail Maelstrom has to go off. Hey, let's go. Got him. Alright, we're we're contending. We out here. Alright, it's heads up, so I need to do the positioning thing. Nice. Alright, let's see what they're gonna do. Um these guys are going to jump the Slark, which I kind of want. I guess possible I want to... It's possible I want that, actually. This is our moment. Nice to get two off, but yeah, it's not gonna happen. Alright, they got us. I wonder if I positioned to the right, would it have done anything? I probably should have done that. But see, I didn't do it because I won and I, I looked and they didn't change anything. So, I just, I didn't even bother. So, oh well, that was a good game. That was a good game. This shows up. Hopefully y'all enjoyed it. I've, I've been liking this game a lot lately. Like I just kind of, I just been grinding and jamming it. So. Yeah. Um, let me know if you guys want to see more of this. And if you do, just leave a comment below in the comment section um, it is free to play so not that this is like a beginner's tutorial or anything like that but the game is free to play and there are some elements from card games there's some skills that you learn in card games that transfer over to this this game pretty well especially if you enjoy drafting in uh, card games like magic eternal um, etc so But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, leave a like if you like the video. And uh, depending, we might we might see more content like this. Maybe something a little different from this than a typical game that'll still be like Underlords related. Because I, I definitely have some ideas. But yeah, let me know. Anyway. I will check you guys out later. Take care.